All right, Matt Bell here with Thought Space Athletics, and we're gonna take a look in my bag. So for starters, we got this beautiful Halo Destroyer with a nice Thought Space stamp. I have a couple of these that are probably gonna be my main bombers. And then uh, right next to that, we got this Double G Emperor. You may remember that from uh, Vegas last year, the famous Par 4 Ace. So I got one of those now. Watch out. Uh, I got this Hurricane that I've been seasoning for the last couple years, and uh, this will be for really long turnover shots. Be able to get this one down there. Anybody that competed against me in 2014 in NorCal will remember this Eco Star Destroyer. Still working nice. So I'll be uh, hitting long straight shots with this one. And now we're going into the drivers from Thought Space. Got two beautiful new Animuses. And these ones are pretty overstable. They have a few different plastic types and they all fill different slots in the bag. So I'll have a number of these I'll be throwing throughout the season. And you'll know when I throw them, they're gonna be right up next to the basket. Um, I have a couple pipelines that I'll be filling in slots in my bag with. And to complement that, <laughs> We have these beautiful, this beautiful glow mantra from Thought Space Athletics. This is gonna be just really smooth hyzer flip shots. And I'll be throwing a number of rollers with these too as well. Did I mention these stamps are amazing? For those that have seen them, they know. All right, to continue down the uh, fairway driver line, I've got a number of the Votum in the bag. This is uh, the overstable fairway. At least in the winter, it's overstable. Summertime, it'll be a little straighter for me, but still good dependable fade. Be able to throw turnovers with this and have it come back. It also holds up well to sidearm torque. And so I'll be throwing this a lot. This will probably be my highest percentage birdie disc. I can say it already. So I'll be throwing this a lot. Looking forward to that. One more fairway driver. This is more of a utility disc, the Glow Triple X, the old Felberg ones. These are about as beefy as a disc gets, so I'll be throwing a lot of little sidearms with that in the wind. And that about does it for the fairway driver, so we'll go on to the mid ranges. Thought Space Athletic has this beautiful Pathfinder. I have a number of them in different plastics that I've been trying. And these fly really well. These are a very dependable mid-range. You can really hammer on them and throw them flat and they're not gonna turn much on you. Throw hyzers, turnovers. They're gonna come out of the turnover. You can even throw a little sidearm flexes with them. So really looking forward to seeing what these do on the tour. Uh, I got a Glow Rock and a Mako 3. Again, if you... Uh, Played against me in 2014, you'll remember these ones. They're back in the bag. Moving on to the putters. This is more of a utility disc and approach. I got one of the Thought Space Stamp Tactics in the bag now, so you'll be seeing me throw this one quite a bit. As well as the Praxis. This is another putter from Thought Space Athletics and moderately stable. You can get some good turn out of it at high speed and then at slower speeds it will fade back. So really useful disc for weaving through and they fly relatively straight. And then one of their newest putters here is the Muse. And this one is a nice overstable complement to the Praxis. So if you get a little bit of a headwind or if you need it to fade a little more left, the Muse is gonna be a really good one for that. So. Another one I'm really excited to throw. All right, and now for the big reveal for the main putter. So far I've been 
trying out the Penrose and I really like it. Uh, I still have a couple other putters to try from EV7. Uh, I haven't tried the Fi yet and I know he's got a new one coming out so I'm gonna have to check those out but for now I've been putting with these and really liking them so I have a feeling these will be the ones. Well that's it for my 2022 in the bag um, and I know Thought Space has some molds that are yet to come out so i'm really excited to try those as well as my signature disc that's going to be coming out soon so we'll see some changes to the bag but for the most part that's the core of it right there so stay elevated we'll see you out there